Welcome to Michelle's Sanctuary. You're listening to a hypnotic bedtime story and guided meditation, The Puppies of Heaven Hill. This talk down will take you on a mental holiday in the rolling hills of a mountainside retreat where you will embark on a summer's day adventure with puppies. I am Michelle and invite you to subscribe if you have not already so you may easily find your way back for future listening. Now find a place that is safe and comfortable for sleep where you may bed down for the night and get cozy. And as you are snuggling down, you may take a deep breath in and then sigh it out. Letting it all go as you find your belly falls and shoulders relax. And inhale as your belly rises and then let it all out in a great big yawn if that feels right. You are now free to unwind without any judgment. Free to yawn and release anything you may be holding from the day. If you would like, you may even clench your fingers and toes tightly as you inhale one last time and then release as you exhale, melting into your bed. Now ready to embark on a much needed and deserved escape. With your eyelids heavily falling upon your tired eyes, you may visualize that you are seated in the back of a town car as your hired driver is guiding you through a verdant mountainside landscape. Looking out of the window, you see lush wildflowers in shades of ivory and pink and red and violet growing along the shoulder of the road. You relax against the leather seat as your head is cradled by the headrest, letting go. As the vehicle gently turns on a dirt road beneath a canopy of evergreen trees with a window open, you feel the breeze against your face. The air is so fresh and purifying. Each breath feels as if you are being cleansed with cool water. It's hard to remember the last time you felt air so clean and fresh. The canopy of trees overhead opens up to rolling emerald hills of lush grass in a valley nestled between snow-capped mountains that cut against the cornflower blue skies set aglow by the late morning sun. You look out to the pastures to witness a trio of goats playfully skipping around a herd of grazing Swiss cows. A hand-carved wooden sign reads, Welcome to Heaven Hill Farms. As your driver guides you over a small wooden bridge, crossing over a metallic blue babbling brook. 
You continue past a stone barn and the main farmhouse, feeling as the pure air continues to welcome you as you inhale and sigh out in contentment, feeling the relaxed bliss that comes with the beginning of a holiday. The driver pulls up to a small cottage located near the gently flowing stream and it is made of stone with a white wraparound porch and rocking chair. You instantly notice a pack of five puppies that are running in circles and tumbling in the grass before your rented cottage where the friendly proprietor awaits your arrival. The puppies are boisterous and carefree, untethered and leashless, and just witnessing their splendor allows you for a moment to realize you are untethered and free to explore and do whatever you so desire on this escape. The car comes to a stop as you take your small carrying bag and thank the driver. As you exit the car, the owner of Heaven Hills comes to greet you and help you with your bags. The playful puppies are suddenly intrigued by your arrival and come running and circling at your feet, sniffing your shoes and softly whimpering in an excited greeting. The proprietor tries to shoo them away, but you are smiling and insist the puppies are welcome to come close. This interaction is the very reason you chose to go on a holiday at a farmstead. You bend down and allow the puppies to lick your fingers as you pet their downy fur, making eye contact with each one and feeling an instant connection. The driver gives a gentle wave before taking off and the proprietor takes over, guiding you up the porch steps while carrying your bag. The puppies trail behind you and wait by the front door as all five of them sit in an obedient line, watching for your permission to enter. The owner opens the door to the quaint cottage, placing your bag on an entryway bench, and you look around the space to see a comfortable bed next to a stone fireplace. This bed is covered in a hand-stitched quilt. The windows are open and a gentle breeze brings a fragrant aroma of fresh grass and lilacs. The owner points to a wicker picnic basket and folded plaid blanket in the entryway, explaining that a lunch has been packed for you to enjoy if you are feeling hungry and that the property is yours to explore at your leisure. You are eager to get outside and stretch your legs and look to the eager puppies with their tails wagging beneath their fluffy bottoms, trembling in excitement. 
and obediently looking for your guidance as their pack leader. The owner explains this is the first time the puppies have bonded so quickly to a guest. And you express how delightful it would be if they could all accompany you on your afternoon exploration. The owner smiles and notes that of course you may enjoy all that Heaven Hills has to offer and to feel free to treat this sanctuary as it is your own. You take the picnic basket and blanket and exit the cottage as the owner says goodbye and that you should reach out if you need anything at all. The puppies, still waiting on the porch, look to you as if you are in charge and you smile waving them on. You decide to follow the bubbling stream and the puppies follow eagerly running alongside you as one tumbles and rolls in enthusiasm before regaining her balance and catching up. You walk beneath the lush trees that line the stream choosing to remove your shoes and place them on a side compartment of the basket so you may feel the cool earth beneath your feet. You decide to dip your toes into the fresh stream, feeling the wonderful chill water that contrasts the warm midday air. It allows you to suddenly feel alive and invigorated. As you splash the water upon your face and taste the slightly metallic water that lingers on your lips. The puppies take this as their own cue to tumble in the shallow waters and play pouncing upon the smooth rocks as they splash one another in bliss. They each take a fresh drink, lapping up the water with their pink tongues. And the clumsy female pup that lags behind is a bit scared to come along. You reach down to pet her and offer encouragement. And with your kindness, she suddenly has courage to run ahead. And for a brief moment, you think of someone who may have encouraged you at some point in your life and helped you recognize your own abilities to try something for the first time or to get over your own trepidation. And this special memory makes you feel warm inside and reminded that in this life you have been loved. Noting how good and carefree you feel, you watch as the puppies continue to explore with their own natural curiosity and realize you too feel quite curious in this new experience and landscape. Walking along the moss that grows upon the smooth stoned shore of the stream. You feel as if your feet 
You're being gently massaged as you balance. Noting how naturally balance comes to you. And sensing how this physical balance took time to develop. And so too has your ability to develop an inner emotional balance. You take this time to appreciate your decision to work towards inner balance and prioritize your need for a mental escape. The stream continues to flow forward and you look as it cuts into the rolling brilliant green hills and meadows that continue beyond where your eyes can see. And amid this rich greenery are hills of wild lavender like a blanket of purple and as you inhale, you take in this beautiful, calming fragrance. And as the land opens up into this rolling splendor, your puppy friends release their boundless energy, running ahead and tumbling and playing as they encourage you to come along. Now is your time to learn from them as you laugh and remember what it felt like the first time you ever rolled down a hill. The grass is soft and plush beneath your feet and you look upon the hills for a perfect place to picnic. You follow the puppies up the next incline of a hill and realize they have chosen this hilltop for you. So you unfold and extend the blanket, feeling as it gently falls to the earth billowing in the soft summer's breeze that is redolent with lavender and overhead birds fly chirping in their own bliss as you look across the meadow and see a doe with her young baby feasting on the fresh grass You sit upon the blanket as puffy white clouds float above, setting a perfect temperature as they cover the sun whenever you feel too warm. And as if set to a timer to your inner rhythm, they disappear when you long to bask in the sun's warm light. And how nice it is to feel physically and spiritually and emotionally content right now. You open the basket and find fresh fruit and your favorite beverage in a bottle along with your favorite lunch selections. You remove the food as the puppies begin to sprawl out on the blanket and whimper as they beg for a treat. You remove a bag of carrot sticks and offer one to the shy girl puppy before giving to the rest of her siblings. 
and notice how our confidence is increasing with your simple acts of kindness and as the puppies blissfully chew on the carrots you enjoy your lunch and beverage and watch as the breeze blows the tall grass and rows of lavender hypnotizing you as your eyes slightly glaze and make the fields appear like a watercolor painting and as your hunger is satiated you listen to the sound of the continuing flow of the running stream behind you and the velvety grasses blowing in the summer winds. You put away all the remnants of your lunch, packed neatly in the basket. One of the puppies brings over a smooth stick and encourages you to throw it. You playfully wind your arm back and tease the eager pups as they jump up and clumsily try to stand on their hind legs. You throw the stick, feeling it take flight in the air and feel a similar freedom within your muscles. The stick lands across the hill and all five puppies chase after it as you take this time to appreciate how far away your thoughts from earlier now are and how more relaxed you feel since beginning this mental escape. And for a few rounds, you throw the stick and play with the pups until you sense they are growing tired of the game. And so too you feel a desire to lay down beneath the summer skies and take a nap. The puppies pile around you on the blanket and begin kissing your face and nuzzling in the crook of your neck, tickling you and sending a wave of goosebumps to rise on your skin. And you hear the sound of your own laughter pure and spontaneous. It causes the puppies to be encouraged to lick your face all the more and tumble on you in this fun exchange in the most picturesque valley. You run your fingers through the soft fur of the squirming pups that roll over one another and tumble, exposing their bare pink bellies so you may scratch them. And the puppies begin to lay down around you and sigh and yawn, exposing their sparkling white teeth and you too begin to feel tired and primed for a nap as you yawn along with them, laying down on your back with your hands nestled behind your head as you inhale and exhale, feeling heavy upon the soft blanket and cushiony grass 
You look to the white-capped silver mountains that embrace the valley of rolling hills and lavender in a jagged hug. Watching as shadows from the floating cumulus clouds appear across the vista. And nestled in this safe solitude, cuddling with your newly made friends, you allow your eyes to watch the clouds overhead as your lids begin to fall heavily upon your eyes and they flutter a few times as you try to take in this beautiful environment one last time before you fall into a restorative nap. And each puppy finds a nook or cranny along your body to curl into a ball or sprawl out into a comfortable sleeping pose, feeling as they each sigh and relax their breathing. You too allow your breathing to relax beneath this blanket of warm sun, ready to let go, to unwind, to drift towards sleep, taking in how soft this moment is, feeling the soft fur of the puppies against your bare skin, the softness of the grass below, and the soft winds that dance across the blades of grass and your blanket like a gentle whisper, the softness of your muscles as they melt over your tired bones and joints, letting go, drifting towards technicolor dreams that will enchant you and carry through this feeling of being safe and cozy and on a perfect holiday, resting down on the fertile earth, you inhale and exhale, drifting, weaving mentally between the comfort of the plaid blanket and the bridge that crosses over into sleep. This happy to and fro before you completely surrender to sleep. And all the puppies are in a deep slumber around you you feel the gentle pulse of their heartbeat, noticing how much your own heartbeat has slowed down as you let go, going deeper and deeper, further down, drifting And inside you feel a warm orb, like the summer's sun in the sky. It is radiating from your solar plexus, warming your torso and all your inner organs. 
healing you within as you inhale and exhale. Serene and grateful, plugged into the moment, satisfied, at peace, and you may rest. Snuggle down and cozy as fatigue takes over. As you let go, I am going to count you down to this place of restorative and beautiful dream filled sleep. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Finding release, finding peace, finding sleep. Good night.